I was wearing a suit with some pinstripes on it, and I had hair. So you seem like such a chilled up person. I've been listening to you here outside. So I was wondering, what kind of driver are you? Are you very like chilled out when you're driving? Do I, I seem like a chilled person from yeah. you listening from out there? Yes. I don't think I sound chill at all. I'm up in here rocking right now. Big energy. <laughs> Does somebody that you've interviewed today have bigger energy than me? Uh, um, yeah, maybe a little. Oh. No, it's not that you don't have the energy. You just seem like relaxed in a way, you know. No, I'm, I'm actually tired and I'm pushing through because I want to be a professional. Good. Okay. <laughs> so what kind of driver are you, though? I'm a ridiculous, I drive very fast. Always. You do? Are you a good passenger? I'm a good passenger. I know the difference in somebody who drives fast, but they're not that good at driving versus someone who's got, you, you could tell as they're weaving in and out of cars that they actually know what they're doing. Yeah, I, I do know the difference. And, you and so people get in the car with me, and unless you're just a person that don't like someone driving fast, it doesn't matter how good you are, you're just nervous. But something about how fast I drive with my skill <laughs> makes people feel comfortable. Do you think you learned a lot of skills from, from driving cars in these films? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They barely let us drive in this movie. So now looking back, I think it's 18 years since you did your first Fast and Furious. Mm -hmm. Do you remember the day on the set for your first film, what that was like, and your expectations around it? Um, to be honest with you, John Singleton, rest in peace, um, he made us do a lot of rehearsing. And so, he wanted us to get very familiar with cars, obstacle courses. So if you look at the behind the scenes, the making of for Too Fast, Too Furious, I mean, it felt like almost two weeks of that. Me and Paul was in the gym working out every day together. I came to Miami with a trainer. He didn't have one. So I said, bro, just come work out with me because I'm not competitive and I wanted us both to just feel great and look great. Um, and Paul is a much better driver than me, um, has always been a better driver. And he's also probably between him and Cody, I don't really know of any human being that has more knowledge about what's underneath the hood of every vehicle there is because he's a real, you know, car junkie. Um, but yeah, it was uh, it was just interesting to, you know, go from my first movie, Baby Boy, my second film ever was The Fast and the Furious. Wow. Um, like this dark, ghetto, dramatic movie to boom, you know, big cars, big action. Um, and so, yeah, it was, I, I just, I really just had a lot of fun and, John couldn't really get us to do much because me and Paul was just cracking jokes all day, every day. And as soon as we rap, we was at the clubs together and wait, going to set every day, like, oh, my God, you know, with the <laughs> early call times because the women in Miami are just so beautiful and there's so much culture. And it's just, we just had a good old time. Good memories. Yeah. Do you remember like the premiere, the red carpet, what that whole scenario was like back then? I do remember Too Fast, Too Furious movie premiere. Yes, I do remember it. I actually remember what I was wearing. Oh, that's impressive. Yeah. What were you wearing? I was wearing a suit with some pinstripes on it and I had hair. <laughs> that sounds great. <laughs> Having hair was a big deal. 
Yeah. It looks good yeah. without hair too, I have Thank to say. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Since I went bald and stopped letting my hair grow in, it's been the best thing ever. I put so many barbers out of business. They're all pissed. Like, I used to make so much money on this dude. Not anymore. But you have to trim this though. But you do that yourself. Yeah. Okay. Pretty. Okay, I'm a cheap good. date. <laughs> <laughs> Hi there, thanks for watching my channel. If you like that video, maybe there's other videos you like here on my channel. So please subscribe, share, comment, do whatever you like. Be happy, be nice to people. And I hope I see you again soon. Bye.